I'm not sure if I've ever seen a coach do this before. A few nights ago, John Tortorella scratched the Flyers' leading goal scorer, Kevin Hayes. Ryan Whitney of the Spin Chicklets podcast made a good point because honestly, I don't remember a coach ever healthy scratching his leading goal scorer. Tortorella's tactics have always been controversial, but there's usually a method to the madness. If you're wondering how they did that game, the Flyers ended up losing 6-3 to the New York Rangers, and they probably could have used some help from Kevin Hayes. To give some context, this was one play that stood out the game before near the end of the second period against the Devils. And it's probably why Torts ended up scratching Hayes the next game. It's a 1-1 tied hockey game and Kevin Hayes tries to do a fancy move at the blue line instead of keeping it simple and his turnover creates a 2-1 chance for the Devils. And although the Devils didn't score, it's the principle of being a veteran player on a rebuilding team and not making the smart play at the right time. I've talked about this before, but John Tortorella is trying to build a culture and a standard in Philly that has been lost the last few years. So when a veteran player like Kevin Hayes does something like this, it goes against what Torts is trying to build and he isn't afraid to use this player as an example for the betterment of the team and identity long term. To John Tortorella, it doesn't matter if you're the leading scorer, everyone has to play the right way. One thing about Tortorella is that he loves to really challenge his team to try and stimulate growth in a player. Sometimes it can go extremely south and other times it can push the player and the team to new heights. Hayes was dressed in the next game and the Flyers won due to a great game from Travis Konechny. Torts would then address the Hayes situation briefly and this is what he had to say. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm not giving an update on Hayes' game. You guys, I'm not going to have the Kevin Hayes update. Uh, uh, you guys are trying to pit, pit him against me and me against him, which is so ludicrous. Uh, so I'm not giving you any update on Kevin Hayes. This is where I think Torts gets a bad rap because people generally think he's out to make a player's life a living hell. In his mind, he does what's best for the player and that could be up for debate. This may be a challenging stretch for the player and the coach, but if they work it out, Hayes could come out of it being a better all-around player in the end. Anyways, what do you think about the situation? Do you think it was the right move scratching Hayes to send a message? Or do you think it's a bad coaching move in general for modern day players? Let me know in the comments down below, and if you can this holiday season, make sure you check out the Drop the Mitts campaign from Hockey Helps the Homeless. If you're looking for a gift to fill your stocking while giving back to a good cause, Drop the Mitts is the perfect fit. Every pair of mitts will provide a full day's worth of meals to a family in need, so if you're interested, I'll leave those links in our description down below. As always, if you enjoyed this video and want to see more, click any of the videos on the screen here.